Welcome back. Get ready to dive into the world of tech with MA Tech. Bringing you the latest updates, reviews, and insights in just a few seconds. The iPhone 16 Pro and iPhone 16 Pro Max are expected to offer significantly expanded storage options, doubling the maximum capacity from 1TB in the iPhone 15 Pro models to a whopping 2TB. This increase in storage is likely due to Apple's transition to higher-density quad-level cell, QLC, NAND flash technology, which allows more storage to be packed into a smaller space and at a lower cost compared to the triple-level cell, TLC, NAND used in current iPhones. While QLC NAND provides more storage and is less expensive, it comes with the trade-off of slower read and write speeds. However, this expanded storage capacity will be particularly appealing to users who require extensive space for high-resolution photos, videos, and other large files, offering them greater flexibility without the constant need to manage storage space. The iPhone 16 and iPhone 16 Plus are rumored to come with 8GB of RAM, an upgrade from the 6GB of RAM found in their iPhone 15 counterparts. This increase in working memory is expected to enhance the performance of these models, particularly in multitasking scenarios where more RAM can lead to smoother and faster switching between apps. The additional RAM is also believed to support Apple's growing emphasis on Apple intelligence features, which requires substantial memory for advanced AI and machine learning tasks. By equipping all devices in the iPhone 16 lineup with at least 8GB of RAM, Apple is likely aiming to deliver a more powerful and future-proof user experience, catering to the increasing demands of modern smartphone usage. Apple's next-generation A18 chips, set to power the iPhone 16 series, will feature an upgraded neural engine with significantly more cores, according to reports from Taiwan. This enhancement in the neural engine is expected to boost the performance of machine learning tasks and Apple intelligence features, making these devices more capable of handling complex computational tasks with greater efficiency. Previous iPhone models, from the iPhone 12 through iPhone 15, have all utilized a 16-core neural engine, yet Apple has consistently managed to improve performance with each generation. The upgraded neural engine in the A18 chips will likely further accelerate these improvements enabling faster processing for tasks like image recognition, natural language processing, and real-time data analysis. This advancement underscores Apple's commitment to integrating cutting-edge AI capabilities into their devices, enhancing both functionality and user experience. Apple is expected to maximize the display size of the iPhone 16 series by introducing a new ultra-thin bezel technology. This innovation, referred to as Border Reduction Structure, BRS, technology, allows for the minimization of the bezel at the bottom of the display. The BRS technology works by compactly rolling up the internal copper wiring, which reduces the border around the screen, giving users more display space without increasing the overall size of the device. Apple plans to implement this borderless display technology across all four iPhone 16 models, but the Pro models are rumored to feature the thinnest bezels of any smartphone on the market surpassing even the iPhone 15 Pro devices. This move highlights Apple's continuous push toward achieving a nearly all-screen design, enhancing both the aesthetics and immersive experience of its flagship devices. The iPhone 16 Pro and iPhone 16 Pro Max are rumored to sport a new polished titanium finish, offering a significant upgrade over the brushed titanium chassis of the iPhone 15 Pro models. Apple is reportedly using an improved finishing process that will give these devices a glossy appearance similar to the highly polished stainless steel used in earlier Pro models. This new titanium finish not only elevates the visual appeal of the iPhone 16 Pro models, making them look more refined and premium, but it also provides practical benefits. The polished titanium is expected to be more resistant to scratches compared to stainless steel, ensuring that the devices maintain their sleek look over time. This combination of durability and elegance positions the iPhone 16 Pro models as a compelling choice for users seeking both style and substance in their next smartphone. Apple is reportedly testing a new anti-reflective optical coating technology for its iPhone cameras, aiming to enhance photo quality by minimizing common artifacts such as lens flare and ghosting. The new technology involves using Atomic Layer Deposition ALD, equipment in the camera lens manufacturing process to apply the coating. 
ALD applied materials offer the dual benefit of reducing reflections and protecting the camera lens system from environmental damage, without compromising the lens's ability to capture light effectively. This advancement is expected to improve the overall clarity and quality of photos taken with the iPhone 16 series, providing users with clearer and more vibrant images. The iPhone 16 series is anticipated to introduce a fresh range of color options across all models. The iPhone 16 Pro and iPhone 16 Pro Max are expected to be available in black, white or silver, gray or natural titanium, and a new rose color. The rose option may even exhibit a bronze-like hue under certain lighting conditions, potentially replacing the blue titanium option from the iPhone 15 Pro. For the iPhone 16 and iPhone 16 Plus, the color choices are rumored to include black, green, pink, blue, and white. This lineup suggests that yellow will be replaced by white, while the other colors from the iPhone 15 will remain consistent. These new color options are designed to offer a variety of choices, allowing users to select a model that best fits their personal style. The iPhone 16 Pro and iPhone 16 Pro Max are rumored to support significantly faster charging speeds, with 40W wired fast charging and 20W MagSafe wireless charging. This marks a considerable upgrade from the current iPhone 15 and iPhone 15 Pro models, which peak at 27W for wired charging and 15W for MagSafe charging. The boost in charging capabilities is designed to counterbalance the increased battery capacity in the new models, ensuring that users can charge their devices more quickly despite larger batteries. This improvement addresses the growing need for faster, more efficient charging solutions as smartphones continue to incorporate more power-hungry features. Apple is reportedly planning a significant upgrade to the iPhone 16's microphone system to enhance the new Apple intelligence features, particularly the Siri experience. This upgrade will focus on improving the microphone's signal-to-noise ratio, which is crucial for clearer and more accurate voice input processing. The enhanced microphone will play a pivotal role in supporting Siri's advanced capabilities, including contextual awareness, semantic indexing, app control, and on-screen awareness. By refining the quality of voice input, Apple aims to make Siri more responsive and capable of handling complex tasks with greater accuracy. This microphone upgrade underscores Apple's commitment to integrating more sophisticated AI features into their devices, offering users a more intuitive and efficient voice assistant experience. Apple is rumored to be developing a graphene thermal system for the iPhone 16 lineup, with the iPhone 16 Pro models potentially incorporating metal battery casings to mitigate overheating. Graphene, known for its exceptional thermal conductivity, surpasses the efficiency of copper, which is currently used in iPhone heat sinks. This new system aims to improve heat dissipation, especially in response to the overheating issues reported with the iPhone 15 Pro models, which Apple addressed through a software update. Additionally, there are reports suggesting that the iPhone 16 models might feature a larger graphite sheet within the chassis, further enhancing the device's ability to manage heat. These innovations indicate Apple's commitment to ensuring optimal performance and user comfort by tackling thermal management challenges more effectively. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more tech content. See you next time on MA Tech.